Hey everyone, it's Robin and Galette, and I'm back at you guys with another makeup tutorial. Today's makeup look is going to be a holiday glammed look. You guys can, however, change up the colors if you'd like. Maybe you don't really like the reds and you want to go with purples or blues, greens, any colors you guys want. Just switch it up, make it your own, and let's get on to the video. So one of the first things that I'm going to do before starting my look is I'm going to grab a blending brush. Right now I'm going to grab the Y17 brush by Morphe. And I'm also going to grab my Modern Renaissance palette. And yes, I know it's a little dirty, but I've had it for so long. But anyway, um, I'm going to grab my Modern Renaissance palette. And I'm going to dip my blending brush into the color Red Ochier. I hope that's how you say it. Red Ochier. I know that doesn't sound right, but we're just going to make it work. Anyway, let's dip into the color Red Ochier. And if you have too much on your brush, we're just going to tap it off because I don't want like a lot of um, product on my brush just because I'm trying to make a little bit go a long ways and we're just going to take this color and blend it all across our crease And so after applying Red Ochier on my eyelid, I'm going to take my Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette and I'm just going to dip into the color Infergo and then I'm going to mix Infergo and Ashes together a little bit and again I have a lot so I'm going to tap that off but I'm just going to mix those two together and I'm just going to kind of try to outline my crease and I'm using a Crease 112 brush by Lamora. And I'm just going to dip my um, brush right back in and I'm just going to apply another layer just so it can come out a little bit darker. Now that I'm done with that, I'm going to take an all over shader brush by Lamora and I'm going to dip it into the color He Devil, which is also in the Urban Decay Naked Heat palette. And I'm just going to grab a little bit and I'm going to try to apply it right where I applied Red Ochier just so I can have more of a reddish hue for my eyeshadow. Now that we're done with blending all the concealer shades in, I'm going to take my uh, concealer in the shade 50 and I'm also going to take my Morphe brush and I'm just going to make cut crease. Alrighty, and so now that we're done with our cut crease, I'm going to take my Stila liquid eyeshadow and I'm going to use the color Smoky Storm and I'm just going to apply that where I applied the cut crease. we're done with the liquid eyeshadow I'm just gonna give it time to dry and I'm just gonna begin with putting on my coconut skin smoothing moisturizing primer by first aid beauty now that we're done with that I'm going to go in with my urban decay color correcting solution and this is in the color peach and I'm just gonna apply that to my dark spots and my under eye circles Now that I'm done with that, I'm just going to take my um, concealer and I'm just going to apply that everywhere that I applied the color correcting solution. Now that we're done blending all of that out, 
an email. Hold up. Let me check. Let me check my email. Sorry about that. Now that we're done blending all of that out, um, I'm going to take my Laura Mercier powder and a Morphe um, face brush. And I'm just going to... Hey, boyfriend. <laughs> Sorry about that. Now that we're done with that, I'm just going to take my Laura Mercier powder and I'm going to take my Morphe brush and I'm just going to dip my brush into the Laura Mercier powder and begin to apply this on my face. Now that we're done with that, I'm going to take my angled brush by Morphe and my Smashbox co contouring kit and I'm just going to contour my face just so it can look a tad bit more chiseled than it actually is. finished with that I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighting kit and yes I know it is super dirty but it is a multi-purpose palette anyways I'm going to take my um, highlighting kit and I'm going to put my Morphe Y14 brush into the color summer moonstone and tourmaline and I'm just gonna mix all those three and apply them to my highlighting areas Now that we are done with all my face products, I'm just going to take my Urban Decay D Slick Solution and I'm just going to spray that all over my face just so I am not oily for the rest of the night. And so now we are done with the look. Psych, I'm just kidding. But now that we are done with our face look, um, I am just going to put some eyeliner and lashes on and then I will be right back. Now that I've popped some lashes on, actually done with my look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And thank you so much for watching my video. Bye, guys.